This video will go over the part 1 questions regarding the topic of fundamental theorem of calculus. From here, g of 0 equals integral of 0 to 0 f of t dt. The integral is from 0 to 0. That means there is no area between 0 and 0. So the answer equals 0. Then g of 1 equals integral of 0 to 1 f t dt that means here so this part is the area of a rectangle so 1 times 2 is 2 and g of 1 equals 2 then this part is 2 and g of 2 equals integral of 0 to 2 f t d t this area is half of the rectangle so 2 times 1 is 2 the half part is just 1 and this rectangle is 2 that means this area is 3 and this area is 2 so 2 plus 3 is 5 so g of 2 equals 5. Then g of 3 equals integral of 0 to 3 f t dt. The area of this triangle is 1 over 2 times base is 1, height is 4, which is 2. Then this part is 2. So this part area is 2 plus 3 plus 2. The final answer is 7. So that means G3 is 7. G of 5 equals integral of 0 to 5. Ft dt. This part area is over 2 times base is 2, height is 2, which is 2. But this is not about the area. It is to evaluate. So this part is minus 2. Here, this part is minus 2. Then g over 5 equals 2 plus 3 plus 2 minus 2. Then minus 2, the final answer is 5. So g over 5 is a 5. g over 6 equals integral of 0 to 6, f t dt. The area of this part is 2 times 1 is 2, but that means minus 2. So 2, 3, 2 minus 2 and minus 2 and 2 and minus 2 is cancelled 2 and minus 2 is cancelled the final answer is 3 this part is minus 2 then g of 6 is 3 the last one g of 7 equals integral of 0 to 7 f t d t the last triangle is 1 over 2 times base is 1, height is 2, the area is 1, but that means minus 1. So this part is minus 1. Then this part is 2, 3, 2, minus 2, and minus 2 again. And then 2 is cancelled. 2 is cancelled, then 3 minus 1, the final answer is 2. So g of 7 equals 2. Number b, g is increasing when g prime is greater than 0. From here, g of x equals integral of 0 to x, f t dt. 
then derive on each side, respect x. The left hand side is g prime of x equals right hand side is just put in here, that means f of x. So this one g prime is greater than zero. That means g prime is f of x, so f is greater than zero. So from this graph. 0, this part is 3, and 7, then f of x is a positive from 0 to 3, and this part is negative. So we are looking for f of x is greater than 0, that means this part. So final answer is x is between 0 to 3. Or we can rewrite g is increasing on 0 to 3. Question C. g is decreasing when g prime of x is less than 0. Then we know g prime of x is f of x. So that means f of x is less than 0. This part. So f of x is negative from 3 to 7. That means g is decreasing on 3 to 7 because x decreases from 3 to 7. Question D. g has a maximum value when g prime equals 0. If g is like that, then g prime equals 0. And g prime changes from positive to negative. g prime equals 0, that means g prime equals f of x. So f of x equals 0. f changes positive to negative, and x equals 3. This is the last one we already know from here. g prime of x equals f of x. And then derive on each side again. We will see g second prime of x equals f prime of x. So f means g prime. Between 0 to 1, the slope of g prime equals 0, and this part from 1 to 2, g prime is increasing, that means g second prime is positive, so concave up. Between 2 to 3, g prime is decreasing, that means minus concave down. 3 to 5, g prime is decreasing, concave down. From 5 to 6 is flat, that means the slope is 0. The last one, g prime is increasing, that means positive, concave up. From A, g of 0 equals 0, g of 1 equals 2, g of 2 is 5, g of 3 is 7, G of 5 is 5. G of 6 is 3. Last one is 2. Between 0 to 1, the slope is 0. That means graph is linear. So this part is a straight line. And from 1 to 2, G prime is increasing. That means g second prime is positive, concave up. So make concave up. Next one, between 2 to 3, the graph is concave down because g second prime is minus. So make concave down and concave down again. And then between 5 to 6, the slope is 0 again, that means a straight line. 
The last one is concave up like this. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, leave them in the comment below. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe for more.